Okay. Um, all right. So, uh, I have this. This is Zelda Breath of the Wild. Uh, this is the, the Switch box, right? Uh, there's the back. Uh, it's, <laughs> it's empty, basically. No booklets, no paper, except for this cartridge. So this, this little guy right here, if it will focus on it. Anyways, that's the cartridge. It's, it's tiny. May as well be for a 3DS. Um, okay, and you can see compared to like a, a PlayStation game, it's smaller. It's more narrow. Honestly, this this box doesn't even. It could be half this size, and it would still be fine. Uh, that's not all. This. This is the Nintendo Switch. Um, as you can see, this is a small box. I mean, this is this is tiny. Look at it. It's uh, it's a lot smaller than the PS4 uh, Pro box, uh, and it's you know, it's light. It's an attractive little box. It will have it will take up very little space on the uh, on the shelves at retailers. So let's take a look at what's inside. Uh, here, here is the Switch tablet itself. It's it's small. It's like a it's like a Kindle, or like a it's like a it's smaller than an iPad Mini, for sure. Uh, but it feels nice and solid. Um, you know, things like this is where the the game card goes here. Right up top, and uh, yeah, let's let's see, let's look at everything else. Um, here are the Joy-Con controllers. Here's one of these. They are small. Wow, look how small that is. I can hide that like in my hand. Um, so these. Just slide right on here. See that? Right on. Click. Very nice and satisfying click. And now you've got the full Monty. There's the switch. This is the switch on the go, right? Oh, that's that's a that's a very attractive little tablet. This is much nicer than the Wii U gamepad. Um, just right away, it just it feels sleeker. It feels uh, more solid and less bulky, less awkward to hold. Um, let's see what else comes in this box. Hmm. Paperwork. No one ever reads that. Uh, HDMI cable. I don't have enough of these. Oh boy. Uh, power cable. Looks like a USB-C connection on the power cable. And you've got the uh, the little deal that turns the, the control the Joy-Con controllers into a controller for the TV. Uh, the um, grip. So that's you know, you can see that. You just you take the controllers out of this. Mm. I've never done this before. This is this is my first time, also. So we're we're experiencing this together. Anyways, you take it out of the uh, tablet and you just oh, turn it the right direction, <laughs> and boom, and you go. Um, so there's a little button on the back here. That really you press and then that releases the and voila! I want one of the um, switches that has the colorful Joy Cons because this is very gray and black, kind of boring. But uh, yeah, it doesn't feel bad. It feels pretty good. Uh, you can see it's uh, 
It's kind of weird. It's kind of funky. It's square, you know? Never seen anything like it. All right. What else do we have? Uh, we have little Joy-Con dealies, the tethers around your wrist. Uh, two of those so that you don't throw it through a window or into a TV screen when you're playing it on tablet mode. And then finally, this is the last. This is a very, very simple box. There's not a whole lot in here. Um, finally, we have the dock. This is the dock. See that? So, you just. So, with the dock, you can just take your, uh, your tablet. And um, yeah, just pops right in. Simple as can be. And uh, yeah. that's it. That's that's the switch. It's so simple. So simple to make. Um, look. Also an amiibo. I'm just gonna, I gotta open it. This is gonna go on the shelf of toys. You see the shelf of toys in the back. We'll see how it works in the game and everything, but. Oh man, you know what I hate about toys? I hate this crap where you have to, like, unwind it in the back. That's terrible, like, at Christmas when you get a bunch of toys for the kids and then each one is like a friggin' Herculean task to open because there's so many little windy dealies and tape and everything else. So, ah. Ah. Link. There we go. Look at that. That is a pretty sick amiibo. Yeah, all right. Focus on me, camera. Focus on me. I don't have a camera person. I just talk to myself. And uh, the camera auto-focuses, ideally. Um, so that's it. We've got the uh, controller. We've got the dock. And you just pop that out. You know, it's a little bit of a process. you got to pop that out. And then you gotta pop these out. See, out they come. And then pop them on here. And voila! We have ourselves a switch. Uh, we have switched it from the dock, and it's, yeah. Anyways, I'm gonna get this set up in another video uh, and kinda take a look at Zelda and stuff. I can't wait to play uh, the actual actual games on this thing but as far as hardware goes first impressions first impressions are everything right and this this feels good this is this is the kind of tablet I've always wanted because you know I, I don't like playing games where it's all just touch screen I want the controls I want the buttons I want the thumbsticks I want the triggers um, I want the trigger warnings I want the safe space uh, okay Oh, oh, sorry, here. One last thing. There's the little, there's the little dock. See right here? Or the little uh, kickstand, sorry, not dock. So that allows you to just set it down, and then you can play in table mode. Um, so that's the Switch. I'm sure you will watch many, many other videos on this very, very nice piece of hardware. But the real question is, how does it play? And we'll look at that next. So thanks for watching. Peace.